in this video everything is fake made by AI except this frame. Do you want to discover how to create these jaw-dropping backgrounds without spending any money or even having to use a green screen? Look, this is just a regular room which I transformed it to an extraordinary studio, a library, or a cafeteria with the magic of AI. With AI, you have endless options. Let's see how to do this. Before shooting the video, consider these key points. Number one, make sure you have a consistent lighting and there is no shadow of you on the background as much as possible. Number two, use a tripod to keep the camera or phone steady. Number three, use a background which is not too busy or distracting. And the last one, while recording, stick to a specific frame and make sure not to move out of it. To take a snapshot from your video, you can use any editing tools like Premiere Pro, Filmora, or CapCut. In this tutorial, I'm gonna use an online free tool called Rhythmix app. Working with this tool is super easy. The link is in the description, click on it and go to this website, then open your video here. Now you just need to choose a frame of your video and click on the export button. Then select PNG format and then OK. Let's move on to the next step. To change the background, I'm gonna use Adobe Firefly which is an extraordinary addition to Adobe family. Just go to fireflyadobe.com, the link is in the description for you. Before continuing, I should tell you right now I'm using the paid version of this but once you sign in, Firefly gives you 10 complimentary generations which can be helpful for changing one or two backgrounds the most. I highly recommend you upgrading it if you want to use it more often. And these are the plans you can use which to be fair it is less expensive than designing a real decoration for each video also it gives you the option of changing your background in each video and avoid repetition going back to adobe firefly once you signed in in firefly go to the image section and then generative fill now easily upload the snapshot you took in the previous step here with this simple user-friendly toolbar you can create magic first i will select remove and brush the extra items I don't need. Perfect, I'll click on kit. I'll do the same for these two parts, the door and this one. Pay attention every time you remove an item or even later when you insert something. Firefly gives you three options to select among so that you can go through and select the best one. For instance, this one in this picture, it has removed part of the table. Here, there is some shadow here. To me, this one is the best. I will keep this one. So far, I removed the extra items I don't need. Now I will go ahead, select insert to make my background beautiful. Let's say for this part, I want to add a bookshelf. So as I selected insert brush, I will brush the area. And then in this section, in this box, I will type a prompt. For instance, a white bookshelf. This one is not the best one. I like this one the most. Third one is not good at all. Right now, what I can do is to, I can keep it. Or if I don't like any of them, I can click on the more button. So Adobe Firefly will generate more. Okay, I will keep this one and click on the keep button. Then I want to add some items here because it's very empty. So again brush and add a picture with frame this one is not good but look at this one i like this one the most so i'll keep it now i just want to add a mug or a cup of coffee here okay perfect i will keep this one i am done with the background i just need to go ahead and download the picture 
To replace the background we just made with this background in my video, I'm back to Vidmix again. I imported the main video before. Right now, I should go and import the photo we generated together. Perfect. Now, I will extend it until the end of the video. Now, the last step is to mask it by clicking on this brush and brushing yourself in the video. Be careful and brush all the parts. Even a little bit on the table in front of me. Okay, now I will play it to show the video to you. You can see that perfectly replaced the photo I generated with AI with my main background in the video. Now simply go ahead, click on the export button, drag this slider to the end and then OK.